the BS Great Contribution is, has to do with the education, mm -hmm. this educational, you know, role, liberal arts, liberal values. Uh, I always felt and continue to feel mm -hmm. that the great comparative advantage of AEB is in the liberal arts and social sciences. What AEB ought to do is not simply to have excellent doctors and excellent engineers. They should have educated doctors and educated engineers. And you're not educated if you don't take courses in the humanities, in philosophy, social sciences, uh, and all these things, I mean, uh, values. If you don't go to the equivalent of CS course, then you're not educated. Mm -hmm. And I'm, I'm, so I want our doctors to be educated doctors. They can be excellent and contribute tremendously in their own fields, but we want our educated doctors and engineers and uh, educated professionals. West Hall and the Medical Gate. Now, why West Hall and the Medical Gate? They remind me of my student days and my joining the demonstrations. West Shore was the hub of student political activity. And I can never ever forget that. So I like West Shore. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it means a lot. It's a it means a lot. I think AB has historically served uh, a great cause. Mm -hmm. Not that it has not had its faults, but every institution has its faults. Uh, I hope that it will continue to, of course, this path of advancement it has been doing for the last, after the Civil War. Mm -hmm. uh, but again, I say that its advancement in, uh, in its professional uh, disciplines, mm -hmm. as well as in the humanities, social sciences, as it advances professionally, mm -hmm. it should never, ever lose its integrity that this is an independent institution and uh, uh, an institution believes in values mm -hmm. with which it should not only preserve but also practice. Mm -hmm. Never permit, it, uh, ne we should never permit any outside pressures to change its course of action. Mm -hmm. AUB is an important institution that ought to continue its mission. Happy 150th year.